Hey, this is Augie, Augie's Locker Room. When you come to the store, you're going to see things that you've probably never seen before unless you've been to a museum. Great items that go back to the Rockney era to the present. Website, augieslockerroom.com. Visit us here or the website. Our last practice viewing of the preseason, Father Jenkins addresses the, the team with Jack Swarbrick in attendance. After that, the kickers went outside and had a great day, yeah. or at least a great moment. Uh, Blake Groupie hit all four of his field goals from 32, 35, 37, and 42, and then Josh Bryan was three out of four, missing from 47 yards. Tim, uh, I was on the defensive side of the ball. Offensively, what would you see? Yeah, offensively, there's one thing became clear. They did show the second unit offensive line. The first unit, I think everybody that subscribes to Irish Illustrated knows, but the second unit did go Tosh Baker from left to right, Tosh Baker, Michael Carmody, Pat Coogan, Rocco Spindler, and it was Emil Wagner at right tackle. Now, Caleb Johnson has been out for a week, but Emil Wagner is with the varsity. Uh, I think Billy Schroth is with the varsity too, uh, but it seems that Schroth has probably worked with the scout team or third team as it is right now. So Emil Wagner is the only freshman on the two deep going into week one. And they bump Carmody inside. And they bump Carmody into left guard, yeah, which uh, was Schroth's spot for a little while, I think, but it makes a lot of sense because, you know, first man in is what matters in, in game number one. There's plenty of room for Billy Schroth to, to grow and for anyone that's not in that spot to grow, but you want Michael Carmody to go into the horseshoe, yeah, right, sure. if somebody goes down. No yeah. doubt. Uh, you know, in 25 minutes, it's hard to see every aspect of the yeah. defense. So I focused on the defensive backs and the linebackers. Looking at the linebackers, the three that you expect were running number one. I, I, I put quotes around number one because it was all against air, right. but it was as expected. Kaiser, uh, Bauer, and Bertrand. With it, it appeared that Leofau is going to be a guy that plays a bit of rover and maybe will as well and you can alternate with kaiser there so they're building depth um what they're what, building depth for game one too because like you know jalen sneed at some point is going to be a backup rover this year tui halamaka at some point prince collie if one of those three goes down or if leofile goes down you want the, one of those other guys yep. to replace him that's why they worked at rover will and mike i think Bauer worked, I think they all worked at all three. I never heard Bauer working at will, but Bauer, you've seen play Rover almost in a, in a package as before. So I, I think the first guy, it's just going to be those four guys rotating, and right. then you start working it in as the season progresses. Right. Xavier Watts was with the safeties. Now, whether that continues through the entire practice remains yeah. to be seen, yeah. and we won't see it <laughs> unless there's video of that. But, you know, I'm really interested. When you watch Ramon Henderson and, and Brandon Joseph, the range that those two have, yeah. Henderson in particular, he's just so long. And I, I'm interested to see how many passes broken up that Brandon Joseph has because right. I think it's going to be a big number this year. Yeah, and Chris, or Chris O'Leary kind of mentioned about Henderson. He's like, you know, at some point he was driving me crazy. I think he meant the spring and maybe early in camp. He said he's really settled in, is becoming to, able to communicate. And I don't think driving him crazy making terrible mistakes. It's just that D.J. Brown, Houston Griffith, and Brandon Joseph right. probably communicate really seamlessly and well. Ramon Henderson is barely more of a defensive back than Xavier Watts. So – I shouldn't say defensive back, barely more of a safety than Xavier Watts. So I think that, you know, there, there's got to be a little growing room there that we all just decided Henderson would be immediately keep it ascending, and that's probably not how it works yeah, at this level. Maybe level off a little bit. But the, the safeties were working on a drill near the goal line using the – using the sideline as an ally, but being aware that the the runner could cut back inside. A lot of praise for Ramon Henderson from Chris Chris O'Leary uh, at that at that point. A uh, little bit of struggle for Xavier Watts. You can imagine, I mean, that like as you yeah. said, I mean, he's new to the position, and now he's caught between two positions. So him being sharp in every drill that they run, offense and defense is a little bit difficult. Yeah, and Groupie and the kickers were going with noise. And now we have, I believe, probably Tyler Buckner going with noise right now. As we were going out, the period six, magical period six that we don't see, always brings the offense and the defense together. They were starting to go one-on-one. -on -one. I will say they were throwing to air when I watched the quarterbacks. Pass of the day for sure was a gorgeous fade route, excuse me, go route by Tyler Buckner to Michael Mayer. And he dropped it, but that won't happen again. So you like to hear that he, uh, Tyler Buckner threw a beautiful pass. I thought Tobias Merriweather dropped one on a dig from Pine, came back, and accelerated after a ball for, a, again, on-air touchdown where you could see his speed really showcase at that moment. And you could tell it was in his mind, hey, I dropped one. I got to go get this thing. That might be the last time we say Michael Mayer dropped yeah, a pass no, in 22 2 Finally, we're working on bunch formations uh, defensively, picks, uh, switches, all the things that you have to do on the fly when an opposing offense bunches three receivers together. That's it for our instant analysis practice reports and interviews with seven cornerbacks after practice, as well as cornerbacks coach Mike Mickens.